I'm Dr. B.J. Lancer. I'm the director of the Pediatric Food Allergy Program at National Jewish Health in Denver, Colorado. And here to talk about uh, peanuts and tree nuts today. Peanuts and tree nuts actually um, is the important first distinction to make. Um, peanuts are actually in the legume family, more closely related to things like peas and soy. Tree nuts, um, as a large group, are, as, they, as their name implies, nuts that grow on trees and distinct from peanuts. Tree nuts um, have a variety of members in their family, um, some of which are actually related to each other. So walnuts and pecans are related, while cashews and pistachios are closely related to each other. But other tree nuts, such as almond and hazelnut, are distinct members of that family. And patients can actually be allergic to only some of the tree nuts. And so it's possible actually for us to, to be able to challenge um, patients to some tree nuts and, and have them strictly avoid others, um, depending on, uh, on their different allergies. Um, peanuts and tree nuts um, often get talked about together, and um, part of that reason is that about 35% of patients with a peanut aller allergy will have a tree nut allergy. Coconut is an important uh, distinction and uh, a bit of a confounder in the tree nut family. Uh, in the United States, um, coconut does count as a tree nut in terms of food labeling, and so it will trigger that warning. However, many patients um, with other tree nut allergies can actually tolerate coconut, and coconut is actually a fruit um, growing on a tree as opposed to the nut of a tree. So um, all tree nuts are not the same, and peanuts and tree nuts are distinct, and it's important to um, distinguish specifically and exactly what a patient's allergies are.